Let's jump right in into the current list of earthquakes that is live. I'll show you the location, guys, because something is going on again in Santorini. I mean, it has never stopped. It's been continuously going on, but this is something. And I said it. I said, I don't believe that anything is coming down. So look at this map here. There you see the location of these pink clusters. And if we zoom in this is we see santorini here the crater and then we see the colombo volcanoes there and there's lots of fault lines here and this is where we've seen this massive earthquake swarm what you see here on that map is only from the last 24 hours so there's way more earthquakes and i'll show you those in a second but you know, they said last night was a little bit calm, although there were a lot of earthquakes on February 7th. But some scientists said, oh, yeah, maybe it's getting less. The magnitudes are coming down. And my gut feeling was, and I said it to you guys, I don't think that this was it. I don't think so. And now look at this list. We have February the 8th, and it's like lots of number four earthquakes and as i'm speaking 3.9 check this out and 4.8 so guys while we speak the earthquakes keep coming so five earthquakes while i wanted to tell you about the 4.8 that we've just seen so look at that pink dot that's blinking here that's the last one and they're getting closer to santorini to the crater to the volcano so this is at a depth of only five kilometers and it's magnitude 3.7 and just right before that we did have a 4.4 also off the coast of Santorini at a depth of 10 kilometers. But then guys, look at this list, 3.9, 4.8, look at the location in the cluster, in this earthquake swarm cluster that could be related to the Colombo volcano where just last year they discovered, they called it a surprise magma chamber that is filling up gradually. And the, the scary thing about this underwater volcano Colombo that has in the very, very past created devastating eruptions with tsunamis, that magma chamber that is swelling there right now has almost the same fill amount that it had when it last erupted. And if you follow my channel, for example, in Iceland, where we see eruptions every month or so for over a year now, they measure that as good as they can. Once the magma chamber reaches the amount that it had when the last eruption started, the fill amount, they ring the alert and they say eruption could come at any time now or in a week or so. And we're in that state in um, Iceland right now. So is that the same thing with Colombo? And there's a land rise measured underneath the Santorini crater and in between. So some scientists say we could see the awakening, the creation of a new volcano, but we don't know where. So let me zoom in here again. So this is really, it's not slowing down. And I said it, I said it yesterday when some people said, oh, it looks like the magnitudes are getting a little lower. Well, look at that. So many fours in a row. We have like, oh, and they, the, the 3.7 was corrected to a 4.0 right now. Or is there a second one? Um, I don't think so, because that dot, when, when is the smaller dot? I can't click on the on the smaller dot. Let's see, when was this one? So that was just a 2.1. Okay, that was yesterday. But here, we have a 4.0 off the coast of Santorini. There's, there's an airport and there's a lot of infrastructure here at Santorini. And if you look at this area here, this is where we've seen the 1956 eruption. There's a small eruption that happened when there was this magnitude 7.7 .7 or 7.5, 7.1. It, it varies, whoever says it. But there was a small eruption and you see the lava carpets here, how they come out of here.
What you see here on that map is only the earthquakes of the last 24 hours. Of course, there's way more, and I'll show you this here. Um, this is an interactive map that shows you the cluster of the earthquakes, how fast they were coming and how fast they were accumulating into a big, big cluster of earthquakes. Amazing, this this earthquake swarm, but scary at the same time, because if you look here, now we, we really, the force keep coming on February the 8th. So this was the 7th and yeah, they were in the smaller ranges yesterday, but then today, 4.5, 4.5, 4.0, 4.1, and then we have another one, 3.6, that's also in the higher ranges, 3.0, 3.3, 3.0 here, and then it goes up, 4.2, where's that, that's here, and then it's followed by another one here, just a few minutes later, right, 8.16 a.m., 8.28 3.8 also here in this area and then just three minutes later 3.4 like five minutes later a 4.6 and then basically three minutes later 3.5 then a few more minutes 4.1 four minutes later 4.8 and then five minutes later 3.9 and then five minutes later 4.4 and then and then a 4.0, and let me refresh this. Maybe we even had another one coming. For now, not, but this is crazy, guys. And we also had a landslide alarm for the port, for several ports at Santorini, because that is a crater. These are the, the tops of a crater that goes down into the water. This is what we see here if I zoom in. This is what you see here, that just sticks out, out of the water, but there's more underneath. Look at this, this is a nice layer that shows it. And there's also a magma chamber underneath. And we have detected just two days ago, they detected with the satellite, a land rise in this area. So what is going on? It is still unknown guys, but the consensus is more and more between most of the scientists, magma is involved. There's also volcanic activity and fault lines. Maybe they trigger each other, but this is getting awfully close here to the infrastructure. And, you know, look at this cliff, how densely populated it is. And check out my video that I just released. There's a lot of illegal buildings on this island without a permit. And a third of them are hotels are related to tourism so is this running into a disaster if these earthquakes keep coming will there more buildings that collapse will they be declared unsafe that could completely ruin the tourist season for this year i mean if this earthquake swarm continues it's ruined anyways yeah i refreshed it and i just said it another 4.3 just a few minutes later and where is it it's here, let's scroll in, it's right in the earthquake swarm, guys. This keeps coming and now just four, 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 four and higher four. So will we see a five pretty soon? Or even something worse, guys, this is a thriller. This is really a thriller that is terrorizing the residents of Santorini and the surrounding islands, guys. So let's hope and pray that everyone stays safe. Bang, guys, they have corrected it to a 4.5. Wow, this looks scary. That much yellow in the list. I haven't seen that much yellow yet there. So, so many fours in such a short period of time, guys. That is scary. I have to say it. It is. But, guys, of course, I'll stay on it. I'll tell you more very, very soon. And I have already told you a lot more what's going on right now. So click this video in the end screen. That tells you way more. This was just a short earthquake and earthquake location update. If you like what you see, please, please, please leave this video a like. Share it with your friends. Leave me a comment. And if you want to support the channel, guys, Go to my buymeacoffee.com slash silky website and buy me a coffee or two. It all goes to my dogs. 
vet bill he's fighting cancer and to my other farm animals so for those of you who have already done that i'm so grateful guys and for the supers that you're sending me thank you thank you thank you and if you want to know more behind the scenes i just released an update about what's going on in the winter um become a member of my channel i would love to see you there everything is in the description of this video click the join button i see you until the next one it's coming shortly i tell you this bye bye